just to get an idea on what I'm doing, but uh, take photos and all the screens, special rotation, special pickos, breeding these large heavy for the half of these birds are largely unable to fly, but their powerful legs allow them to run at high speeds. The size and impressive screen makes them a popular choice when looking for a mount. They are largely too small to allow chuckles to fly. The chuckle drinks enable the birds to glide and fly full damage to itself. Let's ride it up to a certain height. Just not this much. Domesticated chocobos can be deployed as mounts and transport animals. There are even reports of desperate adventurers having to rally to their chocobos as a source of food. In the world, chocobos in their yellow variety found in wildest most parts of the world. Flocks are mostly free, sometimes five animals roam free in the wild. However, they are very scarce and in and they're an interest ornithologist would have to search for wide areas to find a flock. The chocobo's favourite food are glacial greens. These thick red root vegetables can be found around widespread in all fertile areas. These plants can be crafted into seeds. The seeds then can be used to especially grow glacial greens on tilted and moisturised ants. When dismissively growing glacial greens, there is a chance of a root rotating into a lovely or even golden, golden grass trail. These special roots can be, f can be fed to Two chocobos of the opposite gender to initiate a mating process. Okay, so pickles, special greens, can, and sugar can be grafted into a raw special pickles, can be cooked in the furnace to receive the special pickles. These treats are not tasty but also very nutritious. Desperation can be tamed by feeding the special greens. The birds are very fond of the fruit, vegetable, and sometimes form a bunch of whoever is feeding them. A favourite food item, if tamed, then they can be fit with either a chocobo saddle or pack bags on the chocobo. Fitted with a saddle, the chocobo can be additionally equipped with saddle bags. Pack bags and saddle bags can be accessible by a shift right click. Uh, chocobo breeding. If feed with a lofty or golden grisho, I'm not even saying I'm not saying that word properly. Chocobos are diff of different gender can be bred to produce an offspring. These infant chocobos are called chocobos, and even eventually going to chocobos. Besides increasing the number of chocobos in a domestic flock, breeding is the only way to attain different varieties of chocobos available. There is a slight chance of rotation, which can be increased with the use of golden grass shells. The following combination of parents can cause their offspring to mutate into this subspecies. So a yellow plus yellow equals a green or blue. Green and blue equals white and yellow and white equals to black. And black and white equals to gold. To enable the offspring to mutate into a golden chocobo, the use of golden grotto is mandatory. Uh, chocobo colours. Um, Yellow chocobos are the average rarity and have no clear abilities. They can be used, however, as fast riding and transport animals. The green chocobos have the ability to climb, which means they do not have the need to jump when descending a block lift. They are only slightly faster than, faster? No, rather, faster than their yellow cousins. The blue chocobos have the ability to travel fast on water. Although all chocobos have the ability to swim, the blue ones can do it very fast. Thus, are the first choice of transportation when traveling by water route. White chocobos have the combined abilities to climb like the green chocobos and to travel fast on water like the blue, and in addition, they are slightly faster than the blue or green varieties. Black chocobos have the ability to jump very, very high, climb and travel fast on water, also, they are faster than the white ones. Golden chocobos are the fastest variety and are not only able to glide like the others that subspecies but release fly. All chocobo subspecies can glide and avoid damage up to a certain height. Golden chocobos don't take full damage at all. The never, the never is populated by a special breed of chocobo, the purple chocobo. Roaming the hostile tunnels in case of such a never in search of the never in search of the scarce available food. This makes them even harder to find than the yellow cousins. Maybe they never had the purple chocobos developed abilities to swim in lava and fly. 
Check for with pen and area covered with a with straw and encrypted with a water filled cauldron will count as a checkable pen. If a checkable if a hair checkable will stand on the straw near the cauldron will ultimately heal over time. Checkable cakes can be used to have checkables instead grow up into or chicabos instead grow up into chocobos. Take an egg and mix it with two units of sugar, two boxes of milk and two bundles of grain. Finally, garnish it with two gushal greens. Enjoy. Okay, that's actually very informative on what I need. Oh, very informative of what I need to know actually in terms of breeding chocobos and pens as well. So one main thing is I need a poop on sh when my aim is to actually get a chocobo pen or ranch in turn. So. I'm going to have like a, might use that building up, which is after the side set as a, keeping like the rarest chocobos, just like the golden ones, like inside, or the ones that's already saddled, I guess. That's what I'm saying. So one of my goals is to get the golden chocobo. It's the sort of thing, I'm not sure if you can, Read the ones which already have the saddles on them. We probably can, I presume. So it's worth noting that actually. That's what I'm hoping anyway. So I think for the time being, that's keeping tame. So I don't think I'll be going anywhere anytime soon. So I guess I'll keep hold of this chocobo. PD, I guess. I can use that refer to it. And my pickaxe has run out. Oh, it looks like the end of the line, really. There's plenty of redstone about. Um, actually, I do want a bed, actually. It might be worth just grabbing these. These cobwebs just so I can get the string. Did I don't actually come over here just to get the sheep? How many string do I have at the moment? Okay, it's one bit of wool. So in turn, I have to. We're we just getting shears, but to be honest. Yeah. If I just get this bed made, then I should be on my way actually. One, two, two sheep. I know there's one more one. One more sheep. Which is three more sheep over there. Yeah, there's plenty of sheep. Oh, okay, I was gonna say like <laughs> why didn't it jump a bit of wall? Okay. At least now I've got the wall I need. I didn't need to kill too many. So the plan is to um, to make a bed and eventually get a chocobo barn ranch up and going. Um, I need planks. One, two, three. And a bed. Uh, of course, stuff says would be a bedroom. There we go. At least now I've spawned in here. <sighs> okay. What am I getting some of those? What am I checking out that pirate ship at some point? But I think I'm gonna end it here for the time being and I'll start again next time. See ya!